Let S be the set of integers from one through 10 be the universal set. Let sets A and B be subsets of S, where set A contains the elements four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, and set B contains the elements one, four, eight. We're first asked to list the elements of the set A complement, where the complement of set A contains all the elements in the universal set, not in set A. And the complement can be written using any of these notations here. So let's list the elements in the set A complement. Because set A contains the elements four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, and A complement is a set of elements not in set A, A complement contains the elements one, two, three, and nine. These are the elements in the universal set, not in set A. This is the set A complement. Next, we're asked to list the elements in the set B complement, which are the elements in the universal set that are not in set B. And since B contains the elements one, four, and eight, the set B complement contains two, three, five, six, seven, nine, and 10. These are the elements in the universal set that are not in set B. Next, we're asked to list the elements in the set A union B, where the union of two sets A and B contains all the elements in either set A or set B, or the elements in both sets. Which means A union B contains the elements one, because one is in set B, four, because four is in both sets, five, six, and seven, because five, six, and seven are in set A. Eight, because eight is in both sets. And then 10, because 10 is in set A. These are the elements that are in set A or in set B. This is the set of A union B. Next, we're asked to list the elements in the set A intersect B, where the intersection of two sets A and B contains only the elements that are in both sets A and B. So looking at sets A and B, we're looking for the elements that are in both sets. Notice the element four is in both sets, and so is the element eight. And therefore the set A intersect B contains the elements four and eight. Four and eight are the elements that are in set A and in set B. I hope you found this helpful.